Well, what does fishing and us have in common? Boy, I know some folks who absolutely love fishing. They love uh, anytime they can a chance to get away and go fishing. Uh, and they don't eat the fish. They, they live to fish, but they don't fish to eat. Uh, in fact, most of the friends I know that are fishermen, they, they really are catch and release type people. They just love fishing. Uh, you know, Jesus hung out with fishermen too. Uh, several of his apostles were fishermen. At least that was their occupation before they changed careers and became followers of Jesus and apostles eventually. Jesus knew fishermen. And so in Matthew, he walks up to a group of fishermen and he said, follow me and I'll make you fishers of men. Not fishermen, but fishers of men. And that's the challenge they took and they left their boats and they left their nets and their fish and they followed Jesus and the rest is history, right? You know, Jesus makes that same request of us today, those same marching orders for us today. He says, you go be fishers of men too. Be my salt, be my light, my ambassadors. And through your life, through the impact you make, through the difference you make in this world, Lure people toward me. Bring people toward me. Catch men and bring them to me. Because Jesus is the only answer. He's the one that can straighten out every problem we have in life. The two greatest problems we have is we don't have an answer to the sin issue in our lives. And we don't have an answer to the death issue until Jesus Christ answers both of those questions. So his, his marching order for you and I today is through our lives, through the impact we're making in our lives, the difference we're making, the light we shine, go be fishers of men. Bring people to Jesus. Listen, if you'd like to hear more of these type good news things, please consider hitting that like button, the share button, the, the subscribe button. Uh, it won't cost a penny. It'll take milliseconds to do, and you won't receive a bunch of pop-ups. I've tested it. You won't receive a bunch of pop-ups. Uh, it's just going to let YouTube know, hey, there are folks that want to hear kind of some more good news. It'll just help them know that. So consider that doing for me, and let's get the word out so that we can share the good news uh, with as many as people as possible. Listen, you think it over. Have a great day, a Jesus day, and I'm Scott Shepard, and this is Good News.